Have you ever taken the time to intentionally remove energy from other people that you may have picked up sexually? In helping my clients connect to their higher selves under hypnosis, this is one of the things that many of my female clients like to ask. And I'm gonna read the notes from my screen so you can hear the exact question that I ask my clients' higher selves and that they then channel as their higher selves under hypnosis. So the question I typically ask is, can you go into her womb and remove all energy that is not hers, that is not only from past sexual partners she has had, whether that sex is invited or uninvited, but also from any energy of other people that those people had sex with in their past. And then after doing that, can you multiply her energy in her female organs so that it's all native energy to her? And then can you clear, clean, and balance her root and her sacral chakras to allow them to be open, vibrant, strong, and empowered and then tell us what that looks like as you do it. And this is all part of something I do called psychic surgery, where I work with the person's higher self, with angels, with spirit guides, and with the creator of all that is, to do all kinds of physical healings and clearings. So in this particular case, this client's higher self said, yes, it's like a magnet, kind of like a scan, but it's flat and gray right above the root and the sacral area. It's like little pebbles coming up and hitting the magnet, shooting up, going ding, 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 like hitting on metal. It's real fast and there's a lot of them. After they're out, it goes through a heating process over some fire and it melts. The beads are melting on it. They're all just melting, melting, and then it's forming itself into a different shape. It kind of looks like a crescent moon and a star. I think it's going back inside me, said my client, but it's very long. It's not only going into my sacral area, but my entire torso. The energy expands to my arms and my legs and it shoots out this shining, this big bright light all around me. I'm just spinning and dancing in the light, feeling happy and feeling energized. And because I've asked this question in numerous sessions, the answers are never exactly the same. This is just one example, but it never ceases to amaze me how much energy we hold from other people that we have had sexual encounters with and that they have and that those people had and those people had and those people had and so on. And all of that energy can get tangled up with ours. So if you wanna do this on your own, go into a meditation and ask your higher self to do this. And this is the key. You want to visualize it happening, whatever that process looks like, just go with it. Use your imagination and watch it until completion.